and we're starting to do shout outs. All right, so I'm gonna drop the food right next to the arowana, see if he eats, come on. Yeah! <laughs> so we're dropping these guys in one and two and see what happens. All right guys, it's time to go ahead and see how our goldfish bathtub is doing. What happened to my goldfish? What happened to my fish? All right, Slayers, so we're out here with another episode with Lily, Hello. and it's gonna be a regular thing with us. Now, guys, everything you've been asking for has finally come full circle, guys. We are doing post notification shout outs. No, well, not post notification shout outs. We're gonna be doing find the sticker. That is right, find the sticker. I have a whole bunch of small little stickers here. I got blue, yellow, pink, and green. And those stickers will be around my videos. So it could be all green, all blue, all whatever it is. So I'm gonna give you the specifications of what has to be commented below and i'll be doing shout outs at the end of every video from now on are you excited about that so excited. it's gonna be like the hidden mickeys but you know find the stickers on joey slam so today we're heading to petco and we're gonna check on the goldfish we're gonna feed all our fish it's gonna be fun are you ready yeah let's get it so slayers we made it inside petco and we're actually gonna go ahead and look for something for my gulpers yes the ogre blob catfish to eat so as you can see we have some koi but they're not big enough to go ahead and eat the koi yet, nor, nor do I really want to see koi being fed like to my koi. catfish. We got to go ahead and find something, something that doesn't have ick, doesn't have anything because we don't want to go ahead and hurt our no, blob don't. catfish. So I see some goldfish here, the calico fan tails. They're very, very cute. This guy no longer has an eye though. If you look, that guy right there, that guy right there doesn't have an eye. So I, maybe, Maybe we we'll use that guy or the other ones. We gotta find some healthy goldfish right here. We so do. give us a few moments while we find our healthy goldfish for our blob catfish. So guys, we've decided to go ahead and get two tasty calico How goldfish to go ahead and feed Which our blob catfish. After? Whatever you can catch first. But preferably actually the one that has one eye missing so I don't feel so bad. And that's a good choice. That's a good choice. That's what I'm talking about. Go ahead and scoop it up. There's the one. Perfect. Did I feel bad for approaching him from his bad side? No, no. That's exactly how this you speak like, really um, fast. Right there. This one here? Oh, oop. Here we go. We got our two and we're heading home. Whoa, don't run us over in the fish. Are you guys good? Yeah, I think you get. All right, Slayer, so we're back at the house and we're gonna be feeding all of our fish. So something I like to do is mix up their diet. I use a lot of shrimp, use tilapia. I do also use clams and stuff like that, but they really like the shrimp and they really like the tilapia. So I go ahead and make sure I get rid of all the shell, all the excess shell that's there. I also try to go ahead and vent them. I don't want any poop or anything that's in that poop. So I get rid of that shell, I just put this here. Leftover shell, I just use frozen shrimp. And if you look in here, that's poop. Right there, that's their vent. So I have to go ahead and usually try to cut that out as easy as possible. So I just kind of slice everything. I slice the bottom and then I slice in between and then I get it out right here. As you can see right here, see that? Yeah. So what we go ahead and do is just kind of grab that and poop the gone. So I don't want any of that with my fish. I mean, it could be, you can probably feed all this whole, I'm just picky like that. I'm really spooked of having my fish die from being fed something. So I don't like to deal with anything of the sort. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is cut up more of these pieces. Then on top of that, we're gonna go ahead and also add some secret sauce that you guys know that I like to use. And that is Kent, Kent Marine. I put garlic, it's usually very healthy for them as well as it's a great thing to add to your fish if you're transitioning them to different foods that they're not used to usually eating. So it's right here, it's Kent Marine Garlic Extreme. A couple of drops of that, it's very healthy for them as well as it makes the food taste better. All right, Slayers, so time to go ahead and get really excited because I'm gonna be feeding all of my fish. I have Ninja here, which is my very alien-like water cow goby. I have my fish over there, my turtles, and I have my ogre catfish, the blob gulper catfish that are over there, but we gotta keep them in the dark because we're gonna also be feeding them soon. So first, we're gonna go ahead and feed Ninja because he's the guy who always likes to eat, guys. So come check him out. I'm gonna go ahead and put my tongs inside and watch him eat. Here we go. He's gonna get a whiff of that. Oh, he's gonna go. Oh yeah, he sees it. He sees it. Oh my God, I didn't get a chance to go ahead and take that away from him. He's so quick. He's hungry. He wants another piece? Oh, 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 oh. Did you hear that? Yeah. He caught the tongs. One more piece, what do you think guys? One more piece? Yeah, one more piece. All right, one more piece, one more piece. All right, so a total of three pieces, okay? Here we go, here we go. One more, come on, 
Oh, yeah. Oh, he missed. Uh, Toro, Ninja. Toro. Oh, he touched it. He gets the hat. <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's my boy. My boy right here. Ninja, the most amazing fish I own. <laughs> that is so cool. Look how healthy he's getting. Hello, he's getting Ninja. big. He's getting big, guys. So, guys, what's next? We're going to go ahead and feed Godzilla. All right, Sliz. So, as you can see, Godzilla is going through shed. He is grown. He's getting really, really big because we have been power feeding him. And look how excited he's about to get when he sees these tongs. Oh, oh, he's going to go crazy. Can you go ahead and jump over here and get something real quick, buddy? Come on. Yeah! <laughs> Godzilla, my awesome common snapping turtle. So, guys, let's go ahead and feed our big monster. So, now we have to go ahead and do a name change. We had this guy as Hercules and we had this guy as Zeus. Now, he is more like what I like to call Pegasus. Now, my albino arowana Pegasus has been raining terror on all those three arowanas we put in at Farley's place. So we're gonna leave Pegasus over there and we're honestly, I'm gonna let Farley have Pegasus. He's been crazy. We've been having to separate all of our albino arowanas. So Adonis is going somewhere and Zach's lightning is going somewhere. So Pegasus is gonna stay over there. I don't know if his name's gonna stay the same, but I love the name Pegasus. So this arowana is going from Hercules to Pegasus because it's just such a cool thing. He's like a winged animal. And this guy right here, he was named Zeus. And we're gonna go ahead and change his name to Spartacus, right? S for shoveler, Spartacus, I guess it works, but we have Apollo on here, which is my red tailed tiger shovelnose hybrid. And then we have the regular tiger shovelnose, which is named, which is now named Spartacus. And we have over here, we have Pegasus. So I've been training them to go ahead and eat frozen. So bear with me guys, it's been quite a mission, as you can ask Lily. It's been oh, yeah. insane trying to go ahead and feed these guys. So maybe they'll eat by hand apollo is usually the guy that goes ahead and starts the feeding so i'm looking to possibly add another fish to this tank to go ahead and entice them to start eating if you get one fish to usually start eating everyone's gonna eat so i'm dropping some food right on top of spartacus and he's not digging it he's not digging it at all he's kind of upset that the light's on the arowana is not having it either so i'm gonna go actually move the other lid and see if the arowana wants to eat all right, so I'm gonna drop the food right next to the arowana, see if he eats, uh, no dice. So it's gonna take some time for these guys to get used to me feeding them frozen. They'll eat live. You guys have seen it, they eat live, but we're gonna leave these pieces in here. And oh my gosh, I forgot. We still gotta feed the gulpers those goldfish. All right, Slayers, so we have Ninja in the back thinking he's about to get fed again, but that's not the case. These goldfish are going to be fed to the mighty gulpers. Are you ready? Gulpers, oh yeah. All right, go ahead and open up that bag. All right. You got this, I believe in you. Yes. Yeah. Come on. I think I'm just gonna open like oh, this. Yeah, open it up and just pour the contents in the bucket. Because we're just gonna need the goldfish, not the water. Alrighty. So that should be easier for you to go ahead and pick them up. Hold on one second while we go ahead and get ready for this awesome gulper eat. All right, Slayers. So we have our meals for our gulpers here so you guys can go ahead and see. And chill out, Ninja. You already ate, bro. You already ate. All right. So we're gonna turn on the light. They're gonna spook. Are you ready? Here they go. One, two, three. They see what's going on, and oh, they're not spooked. So we're dropping these guys in one and two, and see what happens. So Slayers, I went ahead and turned off the lights so you can go ahead and see and watch the action <laughs> that's just about to happen. It's instant when the lights are off. They're not really comfortable eating in the light, so I still gotta train them. I, I've had them eat in the light before, but they've been very shy lately. So this is, I can tell by their fin, that is Shrek. Shrek ate first. For the first time. Not bad. Cool. And we have Fiona in the back. Will Shrek get a second helping? Oh my oh gosh. My. Or Fiona will go ahead and get hers. <laughs> hmm, hmm, hmm. We shall wait. All right, here you go. Fiona, what you doing, girl? Come on, Fifi. Come on. Use those whiskers. <laughs> that's it, that's it. Oh, what a ninja. What a ninja. Not oh that God. ninja, but what a ninja. Oh, look. Savage. They ate. Let me go ahead and show you guys. They ate. All right, Slayers. So as you can see, Spartacus has a big bulge. He is a fatty. He ate just about everything. He left one piece for Apollo. Apollo got a couple pieces. Fortunately, the arowana, you lose. We'll get you some minnows or something in the future, but I really want to get you on Frozen so you can go ahead and be hand-fed and do some cool tricks. But as you can see, guys, they eat. It's just the light is not for them right now. All right, guys, it's time to go ahead and see how our goldfish bathtub is doing. So we're walking out here, and we have our little animals here, our little guys. Squirt and Crush hiding under the log. <laughs> I love those guys, they just chill right there. And, oh my God, it's cleared up. It's starting to clear up. Look at, what? 
What happened? Hold on. Where are my goldfish? Where are all the goldfish that we just bought? I don't know. Where are the goldfish? Hold on. This is not the hundred goldfish we got. They're, they're the big, bottom. but they're not at the bottom. What happened to my goldfish? What happened to my fish? All the pedicure fish are missing. And I couldn't really see them because of the green. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what? Feed them to see if they come up. Okay. Let's see what comes up. Anyone? Guys, hello? Hello? Dude. What's up, man? What happened? So, we no longer have the algae bloom, but the algae bloom also took our fish. I'm so confused. I'm so freaking confused. Like, Let's I know see. that's not legit at all in regards to the algae bloom taking our fish, but what happened guys in the comments below let me know what went down i mean i, I had so many gar rufus the pedicure fish so so much for getting lily's feet like done and stuff and as well as we just ordered a hundred goldfish and they're no longer oh. here well this is sad me that's rare yeah so guys if you're new to the channel this water had an algae bloom it was just like that black and it was covered and now we only see <gasps> oh my gosh guys my heart the original og goldfish didn't like everybody oh, no. and they went ahead and attacked all the new goldfish and the gar rufus these are all the fish i've had for years in the goldfish tank oh my god well guys our tank is relatively clear, it got clear. and i guess the gar rufus did their job and everything but it came at a cost guys so man this is this is kind of really sad, sad. <laughs> this is very sad well, babe, don't be sad. We still have our OGs, which obviously, as you can see, they're absolute savages. They still yeah. suck on your hands. So we have the originals. There's many moves. They're the commandos and everything from we got from Catch Em All Fishing. We have all of our Skittle squad as well. There's mittens. We have everybody that's from the beginning, from the way beginning when we rescued everybody first. But they didn't want anyone else inside of their tank, so. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm gonna put this away. And guys, oh, how can I forget? Um, in the comments below, if you wanna go ahead and get shouted out in this video, like I said, we're starting to do shout outs. First, how many stickers did we use? Second, what color were those stickers? And third, how many pieces did Ninja eat? So guys, if you go ahead and put those three answers below, I will be choosing a winner and shouting them out in the next video. With that being said, guys, I'll see you in the next adventure. Booyah. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.